In this video, we will show you how to change the load settings on a low profile Type 18 constant hanger or a Type 19 low profile support. It sometimes is necessary to make load adjustments in the field due to the changing conditions. Our low profile hangers are used where there's not enough vertical space to use one of our standard constant supports, which is taller. These constant supports come with a travel range of 3, 6, and 12 inches of travel. And adjusting the load does not change the travel range whatsoever. Please make all load adjustments with the approval and supervision of your responsible engineer on site. Let's start by looking at all the items that are important when you're changing the load. Uh, look first at the nameplate. All the information you need is here. First is the model number or the type number. Next is your original calibrated load. And then here is your hanger mark. The load scale is located here. The travel scale is located here. Uh, when it's time to remove your blocking, they go over here on the side. There's a gold bolt. It's actually put there for storage, to store your blocking. So, now, so that you can more easily see the load adjustment bolts that uh, we're adjusting today, I'm going to turn this constant over on its side. Inside the support, located here and on the other side of the unit, are two 17 millimeter bolts. By adjusting those bolts, tightening or loosening the bolts will change the focal point on the lever as shown in this picture. I'll be using an air tool today and we will look at the direct load reading device here on our travel or our load scale and we will adjust the other side the same amount and we have just increased the load on this unit by 50 pounds. Once you've increased or decreased the load that you are uh, trying to get to or trying to achieve, the next thing you do is lock your locking washer or your locking nuts back down. Take our 17 millimeter wrench and now that is locked in position. You can see here that these plates on the end are also adjustable. These four gold bolts are how we calibrate the unit and should never need to be adjusted once they've left our facility. They will be locked by these locking nuts. If you have mistakenly adjusted this, trying to increase or decrease load, your unit is now out of calibration. Now you can call us here at our facility and we can try to talk you through and get this back to its original place or the unit will need to be sent back to us so we can go through the calibration process again here in our machine. And that's all there is to adjusting a type 18 or 19 constant unit. Please don't hesitate to call or email your Elisica contact if you have any further questions and we greatly appreciate the opportunity to serve you.